morning, day four of our overland track experience. So about nine o'clock we made it to the hut late early evening yesterday and we did actually sleep in the hut last night. It was just too much. But we did get some sleep, so I kind of had to sleep on my side. So I couldn't lay on my back, so I couldn't straighten my leg out. So we're going to weigh up our options today. So it's obviously a resto today, and pretty much just lie on my back all day, stay off it. How about this review? That's Mount Oakley. This spectacular site. This is one of the the real treats of the Overland Track and this amazing hut. So we believe there's a ranger coming later this afternoon and there's another school group coming this way this afternoon, so between that Maybe a satellite, a couple of satellite phones, and then we can kind of work out options. And just don't know what we're going to do. So it's can't can't take any weight so on the knee. So not looking promising to walk out, but yeah, we'll see. Look on the bright side, look at the views. Worked hard to get here, so at least enjoy, try to, what we can, try to enjoy today. So we'll just try and show you what the knee looks like. So it's well truly blown up. See pretty much just from this morning. This one, normal, skinny, big balloon. Look around there. So we just had a doctor, another one of the four doctors, tell me it's a potential ligament that I've ripped. So we just had our breakfast, we're just going to have a, have a lie down and then wait for the ranger. Come and give us some advice. So it's about midday, day four, just having a bit of a poke around. This is Four of us here, me and my wifey and a young, a young couple, also having a rest day, so I'm just waiting for the ranger to turn up. Beautiful day, such a shame that we can't get over to New Pelion, uh, Old Pelion Hut and go for a swim. He's kind of I know I should be off my feet, but up like a big balloon. This is where we camped last year. Great little spot here, right at the track junction. And you've got plenty of other little other group sections over there, plenty of other little grass areas around. Reasonable quality, so it's a good spot to actually Face yourself for a couple of days or so. If you come in from our river track, it's a perfect spot. Face yourself before you tackle Lossa. Just going to go wander up here. See if the range is in. And that's the. The ranger hut here at New Pelion. So it's just tucked away down below a little hill just from the, the main campsite, just the other side of those trees. Great little spot, 
Not on the river. Nobody home yet. These are the little Sputnik buckets which they use to collect all the, the hikers' poop and they get helicopters in to fly them out of the park, empty them and fly them back in. So if you ever are in the neighbourhood, it's fascinating to watch one of those airlifts happen. Huts here at Pelion are a little bit potent at the moment. Last year they were great, so this potluck is probably ready to be taken out, I guess. That's why it's stinking pretty bad. Just gonna go have a lie down over here in the sun, soak up some rays while we wait, wait the day out. Still attached. Selling it for you. Yeah. <laughs> I can travel. Yeah, no, I'll be sitting at the time, no problem. I know a lot of guys. I want it to be like Beautiful with the autumn leaves. Oh, yeah. 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 Let's look at this. Well, let's compare the pair. <laughs> so we've now had five doctors and one paramedic tell him he's torn a ligament and needs to be evac'd out of here. But it took a solicitor to finally listen, to Boy. make him finally listen that he has to go out. So we have now determined we will not be hiking out of here. How's it feel? <laughs> You're loving this. <laughs> I'm not the clutch, mate. <laughs> Look at that. Ouch. That's enormous. And all that bruising all around there. You sure? Okay, now put the ice back on it. Just like the solicitor told you to do.